Can you expand from, uh, and that's a good point, you guys have, have a good brand on delivery, being to, able to deliver, but track record matters. Talk about some of the things that people need to know about around you, what you guys have done and your track record, because you know this SLA kind of vapor that's out in the cloud right. is elusive for a lot of companies don't have a lot of uh, right. delivery capabilities. There's a lot of cloud washing out there, or as cloud washing essentially, that people say they're cloud, but they're not. Can you talk about that track record sure. and, and what makes that CSC formula work and how does that fit in the cloud and big data? Right, but one of the things people don't know about CSC is that within the $16 billion company, we've got a $2 billion software business. So, so one view of the Rubik's Cube, if you will, is we've got a, an SAP within the company where, where we have the business model is largely software license and maintenance. And these are vertical applications, predominantly in the financial services and the healthcare industry. So with that insight, you know, think, think of, a, of an SAP and Oracle business model. We're, we're actually transforming those businesses. The leaders of those businesses are trying to figure out how to deliver their business critical applications, which support mission critical processes in, 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 a, in a more effective model, i.e. through cloud. So we're living the business model transformation, and we're also living the experience of using our own infrastructure and our cloud strategy to, to transform these business models internally. And as we do that, as we drive this enterprise transformation, we'll share those insights with our clients, with other ISVs. Uh, and and this, is, this goes back to the, again, been there, done it, doing it. Uh, we don't do it arrogantly, but, but there's a lot of rich learning that, that we're able to share with our clients. And that's really what, our, what we're doing around the cloud, around applications, software as a service, and then business process as a service. In those models, just the final point is, we're actually been in this business for about five years now, where we're on the BPO side, where we get paid by the outcome. So when you think about insurance claims transactions, you think about banking back office transactions, we're actually offering services to clients, mainframe based today, where forget SLAs and a quality of service, we're getting paid by the business outcome. And we think that's the future of cloud, and, and everything we're doing today is to take that that knowledge and understanding of where the market needs to go, where it wants to go, and to begin to build there you know, starting today. So, so it's, it's clearly a journey. That's a real